Okay, now moving on to my PlayStation 2 collection. Here's some Grand Theft Auto 3. You can wander along, wander around Liberty City and cause some mischief. Liberty City, USA, the worst place in America. You've been betrayed and left for dead. Now you're taking revenge unless the city gets you first. Mob bosses need a favor. Crooked cops need help, and the street gangs want you dead. Boy, I hate to be that guy who's doing that. And then there's Grand NBA Street, the first one. Dribble. The ultimate level boss. Michael Jordan. Good stuff. Good stuff. Hold court against street legends. Bring it. Good stuff. Okay. Hmm. So calm US Navy SEALs. Eh, not too much to say about this one. Of course, back when I was buying Madden every now and then, I have to have some Madden 06. And look who's on the cover! Hey, wait a minute. Isn't he on the Vikings now? Heh. <laughs> Funny. That's Spider-Man. Spider-Man does whatever a spider can. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm, that was horrible. Here's Spider-Man 2. Take New York for a spin! From random crime to global threat, the entire city is relying on you to save it. Wow, that's a big shoes to fill. Good game. Good, by the way. Oh, by the way. Oh, sorry. But even though this is based on the movie, good movie based, not a bad movie based game. Not too bad at all. And then some Onimusha. Warlords. This was enjoyable, very enjoyable game. Very fun. Here's some Dark Cloud. Which again, I should probably play a bit more. Very enjoyable, kind of like Zelda, part of SimCity, part of Zelda. Good stuff. Good stuff. And here's some. Oh, Kami! This is also on the Wii. If you have a PS2 or a Wii, please get this game. Very enjoyable. Good art style, good game, fun stuff. And some Hot Shots Golf 4! This, this is a good golf game for the PS2. They've also made a couple on the PSP, and I think I have one on the PS1 as well. But I'll get to that later on. But fun game. And here's some... Do you... We love Ketamare! Do you like Ketamare? We well, should. This game is fun. And it's based... In a, in a, in a game, and actually, this is the second game in the series. Of the Ketamare series. You just get to roll and pick up stuff. In fact, I have the first game, right? I'll skip ahead a little bit. Here. This is a really fun game. I should do reviews on these in, in the future. The rolling, sticking, never stopping, ever swelling clump of stuff that makes a star out of everyone and everything. Yeah, you roll up the baseball stadium and stuff. You do that. That's awesome. Awesome. Anyway. Going back to my was that? Ah, the Red Star. Another part brawler, part shoot 'em up. And all awesome. If you don't have this game, please get it. This is a really, it's, it's really, really hard though, but me and my friend likes, likes to play this. It's really fun. This hard, it is exactly what this says. This hardcore game captures everything good about the genre. I guess it's based on a comic book, but exactly. It's relentless gameplay that seamlessly blends 
brutal melee with old school shooter gameplay. Exactly. Good game. Please pick this up if you can. This is a gem of the PS2. It's on the PSP as well. So pick up pick up e either one. You won't go wrong. And of course, I have this fighter collection. It's basically which is basically on is just basically I have the PlayStation 2 Soul Calibur 2, Tekken Tag Tournament, and Tekken 4. I thought I'd pick them up. I, I, I'm not too good at the, at the Tekken series, but I thought they were worth picking up. They're not too bad. I enjoy it. I do enjoy them. Now, even though I'm not too, as good as them, no, I'm not as good. I'm more of a Street Fighter guy. But hey, they're all fun. But anyway, moving on. Here's some Oni Musha. Oops, sorry. Pony Musha 2 with not someone else. Can you play somebody different? And this is 10 years that you play as Jubei. This Jubei here. I think I'm pronouncing him right. I might, I might be butchering his name. But it's a fun. This is a fun. Also a fun name. Good stuff. Ha. And some bully. This is more. This is also a Rockstar-made game, open-world game, but it was much. It was more. It, was, it wasn't as violent. It was more about like basically you're this bully uh, 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 in, in a private school, and it's a, it's a tongue-in-cheek look at school. That's good stuff. Very enjoyable. I believe it came out for the Wii and an updated HD version for the Xbox 360. So, good stuff. Not too bad. Very enjoyable open world game. Good job, Rockstar. And here's Jack and Dexter. Another fun platformer, a precursor legacy. Good stuff. Made by Naughty Dog. This is very, very enjoyable. Very good platformer. They made some sequels too, which are quite fun here. And then there we go. How about? How about some Disney with your Final? Put some Disney with your Final Fantasy, or something like that. This was a very good mashup of the Disney and Final Fantasy games, or screwed the money. Meaning, yeah, yeah, meaning the Final Fantasy games. Although the this is very enjoyable. I really enjoyed the first Kingdom Hearts game. You get to fight against, you get to fight against different Disney villains as bosses like Jafar, and. Ursula from the Little Mermaid. And you get to go in this and you get to explore rooms like the the, the 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 Halloween town from the Nightmare Before Christmas. Did you get to have, you get to meet the genie in Agrava from Aladdin, among other things. But good game. And after beating this one, it was so awesome. They made a sequel. And this game was even this game improves on stuff. Very enjoyable. Of course, the story is not over. Encounter even more Disney heroes and villains. Travel to amazing roads you've never experienced. Use powerful new techniques, magic, and combination attacks. Experience an adventure larger and deeper than ever before. Now if that doesn't sell you on this game, I don't know what does. And this is the greatest hits version of the game because I kind of missed it the first release but I'm happy I got both this and and the first one I'm happy I got these both fun stuff and then some light gun shooters here Time Crisis 2 fun light gun shooter helps you have an original CRT or boob 2 PB they don't work on TVs like this anymore which makes me sad but that's why I have 
that bad boy. Yes. Anyway. This is Vampire Knight. Another light gun shooter. Good stuff. Good stuff. I like it. You get to shoot zombie, well, shoot vampires, among other things. And then... Hadouken! Huh, sorry. Kind of can't resist. This is the Street Fighter and Street Collection. You can play Third Strike, Street Fighter 3, or Street Fighter Hyper Street Fighter 2, the Anniversary Collection. And an old bonus feature, full length feature film, Street Fighter 2, the animated movie. And here for the Anniversary Edition, mixed and matched characters from previous Street Fighter 2 games to create countless dream matches. Good stuff. Good stuff. And then some Beyond Good and Evil. Another fun game I thought I'd pick up. From Ubisoft. This is enjoyable. Exposed the conspiracy. Ah, sorry. Exposed the conspiracy. Capture the truth. And then here I have two SMK games. The compilation of the Fatal Fury Volume. Fatal Archives Volume 1, I think. Think. Yep. And then Neo Geo Battle Coliseum. Dribble. Rain Dribble. And of course, it's com competition again. More Hadougans. Some Street Fighter Alpha Anthology. Good stuff. Good stuff. And this has Street Fighter Alpha. Alpha 2 Gold. Alpha 2. Alpha 3. And Gem Fighter Mini Mix. Oh, sorry, Super Gem, yeah, Super Gem Fighter Mini Mix. Good. So, good stuff. Ready, set, fight Alpha Style. Of course I'll fight Alpha Style. If Alpha means throwing awesome Hadoukens at people. <laughs> okay, wow, no, okay. Oh, here we go, on the last part of my PS2 collection. Here's another PlayStation wrestling, here's another wrestling game. And this time I'm on my PlayStation 2, the SmackDown, WWE SmackDown vs. Raw. Two rules collide. Hmm, anyway, moving on. Some God of War, another fun, fun game. I. I actually played through part of this, but then God of the God of War collection came out and on my PS3, so I stopped playing this one actually. You are Kratos and you will murder the God of War. Wow, that, that that's a big thing to do, I think. But yeah. Good stuff. And then here's the one before the Madden. 2005 Collector's Edition. Back when I had a lot of money to spend on. More money than I do to spend on games. Up, oh, nothing there. And then here is... Still want to see how far, far down the rabbit hole goes? Huh, <laughs> sorry. Had to resist. Couldn't resist. But this time playing as Neo. From... Which is... Good stuff. This was a, this, I did find some fun with this. This was a very, I thought, even though it got subparts, it got lukewarm reviews, but I thought it was pretty cool. I got this, it was a, got this with some Christmas money a while ago. I figured, I got, you know, it was fun. I thought, I thought it was all right that I'd give it a shot. Fun to stop bullets and stuff, so. Yeah. And then this, speaking of movie based games, this also got some lukewarm reviews, but. I didn't mind. I got it when it was a little bit cheaper, I think. But I enjoy it. I got it. I like it. I thought it was a good little brawler of sorts. You know, play as Anakin or Anakin and Obi-Wan Kenobi. And I thought it was alright, although it got a lot of guff for just being an, uh, over being a droid basher. I think it got bashed because I believe, let me think here, because some of, some of, your, some of your animations were very 
very, uh, what's, what's the word? Uh, very... Oh, I can't think of it. Oh, I cannot think of it. They're, they're, they're very ex extensive, like you'd keep... The animations are extensive, and... When you did animation, it, you did mo it was more than, 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 than what was needed, I believe. But I liked it. I thought it was alright. And it's the ultimate Jedi action experience. But that was alright. Anyway, moving on. Why look, it's Grand Theft Auto, but this time in Vice City. Welcome to the 1980s. Hmm. 1980s? I'd rather, I'd rather, I'd rather be... Nah, never mind. Anyway, 1980s. So this game was cool because it had... This was another Rockstar open world game, but it had 80s. They used authentic 80s music, which was kind of neat. Hey, look, it's Dante Culpepper. But this, but when he was on the Vikings, when he actually was good on the Vikings. But uh, of course, he was. This was known as the Madden Curse because the year this game came out, the season that this came out, he didn't do too well. <laughs> It was not too good. Anyway, moving on. Here's some Simpsons Road Rage, which is basically a crazy taxi ripoff, but a fun crazy taxi ripoff. It could be as Bart or Homer or Mars and just fairy people everywhere. But it was enjoyable. I enjoyed it. And then now, I won't take these out, these next two, but here is the Capcom's Classic Collection Volume 1. Has a lot of games, Street Fighter, Final Fight, a lot of other, let's see, if I, I will take this out. It'll have uh, Legendary Wings, Manic Commando, Gunsmoke, among others. And then, I have the one after it, Volume 2, which has more Street Fighter, uh, and some uh, Kevin Commando, Last Duel, the original Street Fighter, now Street Fighter 2, the original Street Fighter, Quigs and Dragons, Barth, Knights of the Round, among others. And then here's more Capcom goodness. Fighting of Capcom Fighting Evolution. A tribute to classic arcade fighting games. This was an enjoyable little game. I enjoyed this. Very mixture of many different Capcom fighting games. You got to team up and fight, which is good stuff. From the characters from Street Fighter 2, Street Fighter 3, Street Fighter Alpha, Darkstalkers, and Red Earth. Never before released in the US. Good stuff, but I, I, I enjoyed it. It's great fun. Good stuff. And then, and there's the Scorpion King, based on the movie, or it's based on a story before the movie begins, but it uses the same characters. And then, some Gran Turismo 3, which was quite fun, very really graphically good, but quite fun. Another Smackdown vs. Raw game, this time 2006 this time. And then some Lego Star Wars, the video game. Based on the prequels, not the not the episodes, not Return and Star Wars: New Hope and Empire. This was the Phantom Menace, Attack of the Clones, and Revenge of the Sith. Anyway, moving on. Here's my in, my unopened. See, my unopened. God of War 2. I am Kratos, the new God of War. Wow! Maybe I should play the first game to see how he becomes the new God of War, eh? But this was cool, this was... yeah. Good stuff. But this is an open. I have it on the PS3 now, so... I probably don't need to open this up at all. And then another... SNK game, the Roll of Heroes Anthology. Good stuff. Good stuff. And then, Smart Final Fantasy 10 2. 
My friends say this is a really horrible game. Marcus, never play it. Do not play it, please. So. Oh, okay. And then our next another RPG, some Xeno Saga. Drew Wheeler mocked. I bet I just butchered that right there, but not bad. I thought I'd pick it up. My friends, one of my friends, thought this was funny. I and watched him play. It was enjoyable. Music performed by the London Philharmonic Orchestra. Cool. And then here's some Max Payne. New York. Figured of under cup. Nothing to lose. And then here's some Lego Star Wars 2. And this is covers episodes 4, 5, and 6, the original trilogy. So build and battle your build and battle through the original trilogy. In fact, let's put that right next to the let's put that right next to this. And then another Grand Theft Auto game, San Andreas, which had some which had some controversy with its famous hot coffee incident that was hidden in the game. But I'll let you look up on the internet for that one. I'm not gonna thank you. At the moment. Okay. Wrapping up here, here's Oni Musha 3 with Jean Renault right there. Demon Siege. Two heroes, one destiny. Good stuff. Anyway, moving on here. Here's another SmackDown one. Before let's cut a SmackDown one as well. Here comes the pain. It's a little Brock Lesnar on the title on the cover. Those of you know who he is, cool. If not, that's okay too. So he's just I think he fights in the UFC now, I think. I believe. Anyway, and then finally wrapping up, here's my last my two light two more light gun shooters. Time Crisis 3, which is very enjoyable. And Project, I mean, Time Crisis Crisis Zone, which is fun to play. Anyway, this, well, alrighty then, this, that's the, this is part three. I am thanking you all, I will, part four will be coming up. I will make this a multi-part series on my collection. The next part coming up will be, this will be my PS3, and my ex, in fact, I might do PS3, I might do PS3 and Xbox next. But we'll see. I'll, I'll see what to do next. I have the next part of my collection will be very, be very, yeah. Hey Marcus. Anyway, the next episode I will do will probably be my PS3 and Xbox collection. So it'll be a bit shorter. Yeah, if I want to, I'll probably do some of these other ones, but we'll see. Well, anyway, thank you for watching this part three, and I'll stay tuned for part four coming up. So, game on, everybody. Be safe and game on.